guys, so today I'm going to be doing a quiz called Who is your soulmate? So yeah, let's just get right into the game. What is the most important quality in the people you surround yourself with? Similar values, other, fun to be around, loyalty, good looking, sympathetic, intelligence. Ooh, <laughs> I feel like it always has to be fun to be around because if not, then it would be awkward for me. So I have to be around people that's just like really down to earth and they don't make things awkward because I'm already a really awkward person and awkward plus awkward is not good. <laughs> so fun to be around it is. Are you a good listener? I feel like I am like the best listener <laughs> just because I mainly listen to people. So yes, I am. Where does your strongest childhood memory take place? Other over Sunday breakfast at a friend's house at school on a family vacation on Christmas morning. Oh, I feel like it would have to be at school because I have so many strong childhood memories at school, like funny, sad, exciting. They just all take place at school. So at school it is. What do you do when your phone rings? Oh my gosh. <laughs> For me, I personally don't like answering phone calls so I'll literally just leave it to ring and then I would call back <laughs> I'm such a bad friend but honestly I just hate answering phone calls for some reason like it gives me so much anxiety like I'm like oh my gosh someone is calling should I answer or not should I text them instead so yeah I'm a really bad person like I hesitate before answering a phone call so yeah, <laughs> I'm such a bad person. I hate phone calls. I can't deal with phone calls. Ignore it. If it's important, they'll leave a message. It depends on who is calling. Answer immediately. Hesitate and answer eventually. Oh yeah, it also depends on who is calling. So if it's like a family member or my best friend, then I would answer it straight away. But if it's like anyone else, I would probably just hesitate and answer eventually or sometimes I would ignore it <laughs> because I hate phone calls just text me instead so yeah I would choose hesitate and answer eventually have you ever enjoyed just sitting in silence with someone you love yes I honestly just love to sit in silence like sleeping <laughs> Honestly, when friends come over and you just sleep, that's like such a precious thing. I feel like that's so important because, I don't know, it's just like spending quality time. Sleeping is also quality time, okay? <laughs> is there someone you trust completely? Yes, my family, of course. <laughs> Which one of these things do you wish you had more time for? Family time, quality, alone time, learning a new language, pursuing your hobby, being creative, reading, exercise, volunteering. Oh, I think it would have to be volunteering because I don't really have much time to volunteer and I do spend a lot of time with my family. I do spend a lot of alone time like right now filming so that is alone time and pursuing my hobby is basically YouTube, reading, yeah I do exercise so I feel like volunteering would have to be one of these. Is there one thing that you are truly passionate about? Yes, that is teaching. Oh my gosh, I'm kind of nervous to who this will be but Who's my freaking soulmate? <laughs> oh my gosh, what? <laughs> Why am I always getting the same answer on these things? My best friend? <sighs> okay, I remember getting my best friend for the game Who Secretly Likes You? And I get my best friend again on this? What on earth? Okay, let's read this. Your best friend has been there for you through thick and thin. They are always your shoulder to cry on and your companion through good times. You love all the same things and you share all the big moments in your life. So is it any wonder your best friend is your soulmate? Thank you. <laughs> oh my freaking gosh, this is so embarrassing. But okay, you guys should totally do this quiz and tell me here you get down below and as always thanks for watching i hope you guys liked it and i'll see you guys next time bye